Hi, this is Jeremy Reynolds, and I'm with Autumn. Thanks for taking a minute, Autumn. Hey, Autumn, how does it feel to be homeless during the holiday times here? And saying it's a mission, you're a homeless agency. Well, of course, I'd much rather be with my family, but um, circumstances right now aren't allowing that. So I'm actually very happy to be back at Joy Junction. I called and asked if I could come back here. This is probably the best place to be since I can't be with my family. Because there's support here and things like that. Well, sad you're back, but happy that you're able to be back and give you a safe place to stay. Mm -hmm. You know, the week after next, we'll be doing at least three Christmas meals. Ham, turkey, turkey and ham. <laughs> How does, <laughs> How, have you had a Christmas meal before the mission? Um, I've had Christmas. I had Christmas here at Joy Junction last year. As a matter of fact, I was in the program at that time. And how was that? It was fabulous. I mean, at that time, we still thought it was going to be my last Christmas on earth because my cancer had gotten so bad. Yes. And my gosh, the parties and the happiness and the joy and the food, so much food. I had the time of my life, and I'm actually looking forward to doing it again. <laughs> what would you say to the donors that make this a reality because we don't get any government money mm -hmm. so without the donors this wouldn't be happening oh my gosh the donors as i've learned from doing my own research and i never go by what i hear about a place i always research it myself the donors are what make joy junction happy i mean they're the reason why we are all looking forward to the holidays because if they their hearts weren't opened and they didn't give then we'd be like the poor person who's still going to be sitting on a street corner wrapped in a blanket on Christmas morning. That's awfully sad, isn't it? Yes, it is. It's heartbreaking. And in a country with the wealth of ours, it shouldn't, it shouldn't be happening to anyone. And thanks to the donors, there's a few hundred of us that it's not happening to. So tell me and tell our viewers, if we weren't here, where would you and many other folks be? But where would you specifically be if we weren't here? I would still be in a marriage to where I'd be getting beaten up because my husband has fallen back into active alcoholism. Well, oh, I'm so sorry. I called Joy Junction and they re the person who answered the phone, I believe it was Bethany, remembered who I was and um, said, yes, yes, you never caused any trouble. Of course you can come back. And that's why I had a place to go is because Joy Junction was here. Very cool. So is there anything else I haven't asked you? Um, not that I can think of, <laughs> other than God bless me because Joy Junction's here. <laughs> awesome. Your smile's a winner. I know all pe people that view this are going to be very happy after seeing you to know the support goes to help folks like you and many others. Awesome. Okay. That was easy, huh? Yeah, painless. Hi. Right, <laughs> thank you so much. Okay. Thank are, you. Are we done?